back to Zephyr's Travels, everybody. This week we're staying at Cave Creek Regional Park, which is the second of five regional parks in Maricopa County that we will be staying at. Cave Creek is located just north of Scottsdale, up in the northeast corner of the Maricopa County. This is the second time we have stayed at this particular campground. We really enjoy this park. Um, the location is great because it's out and away from everything, but still close to stuff like Cave, the town of Cave Creek and stores. It's a really convenient location. One of the things that we like about these regional parks is that they offer quite a bit of hiking. And today we decided to take both Monty and Zephyr on one. We do like this trail because it is a little bit challenging, it is a little rocky, and it does go up and down the mountains. Also, one of the things that you may run into is horseback riders, and this is something on this particular hike we did encounter. <laughs> hiking to always bring water for yourself and of course for your dogs. on some of our hikes with Zephyr she is walking by herself but has the lease attached and at most of the parks dogs are required to have a leash on at all times if they are outdoors and being as Zephyr is very good on our hikes we feel comfortable in letting go of her and just letting her walk by herself. Tired. Yeah. Well, good thing we're halfway. You got enough energy to make it back? I hope so. Oh. I can't ride on the dog's backs. That's they're, true. They're not big enough. They wouldn't let you anyways. So we took Clay Mine Trail to get here, and then we just took a little bit of Overton Trail, which is basically for the view, because it's along the edge of the mountain, and it's got a nice view over to the, to the valley there. And now we're just heading back. I don't know what we've walked, maybe a mile or a little bit more. So it'll be a couple mile walk when we're done. It's a hike, not a walk. So it's a couple mile hike? Right. Okay. Which is a little more strenuous than a walk. Yeah, it's over the rocks, over the hills. Through the woods. Through the woods. Okay.
good hike? Yeah. Yeah, it was. Did the dogs like it? Well, Zephyr, she loves to hike. I think my actually likes it too. Yeah. <laughs> This is Watson Lake in Prescott, Arizona. I believe it's a reservoir. Um, this is a park that you can come to that actually has camping here. Though I only think there's about 20 sites and I don't believe they have any hookups except maybe water. I don't think there's electricity at them. The par camping is closed until April. We're here in December, so obviously we're not camping. And it's a little cool, but this is really a, a nifty lake that uh, has it's very very scenic with the big boulders and such so we thought while we were in Prescott we would stop here and use this as a place to let the dogs get a little exercise there's a trail that takes you all the way around the lake I don't know if we'll do the whole trail but we'll do some of it so it doesn't look like some place you'd want to go kayaking yes very much so when it's a little warmer. Yeah, yeah, we don't need to be kayaking on a 50 degree day. No, but it, it's very pretty. Reminds you of the uh, Flintstones. Yeah. <laughs> Bedrock. Yep. Mm-hmm. care if I'm coming. <laughs> so Watson Watson Lake Park is a pretty neat little park isn't it? Yeah it is. Um, we decided to take a ride to Prescott Arizona today and this is one of our stops. It is a beautiful park it's just surrounded by hills and these giant boulders. Yeah. That if you feel you know um adventurous adventurous you can climb up and the dogs did and randy did climb up on one but yeah it's a very neat park and it has this really nice scenic lake here that you could kayak in i can see you're right over here from where we're standing there's a pier out there so i'm assuming that that's for kayaking maybe even rent kayaks here in the summer yeah and it looks like there's people standing on the pier yeah. i mean they may be fishing could be i don't know i don't know yep yeah, it's a, and they do have camping here? Yeah, they have a small campground. It looked like there's about 20 sites, but they do look like some of them you could get an Airstream in pretty easily. But there appears to be no hookup, so, yeah. or no amenities. Yeah, no amenities. There is water available in the, in the park, but it's not hookups for your trailer. And you can come here for day use. They do have a horseshoe pit. You can picnic here. Um, playground. Playground. Looks like there's a field for Sports. playing like football or other sports. Yeah, dodgeball. Right. Yeah, it was uh, a nice place to stop. It's sunny and it's a beautiful area. Yeah. So. All right, well, let's go into Prescott now and check out that. Right, first something to eat. Oh, first something to eat. We got, we're going into Prescott to find something to eat. Right. We may not take you along for the meal part, but we will take you along to Prescott. See what we can find. Yeah. historic western towns, the downtown area of Prescott is centered around a town square with a number of historic buildings and the county courthouse as its centerpiece. Well, in 
Prescott, we did take some time to explore the downtown area and stop in one of the local shops and take a uh, look around. So what's your thoughts on Prescott? It's nice. Yeah, it's a nice little western town. Yeah, a nice little western town. A lot of bars. Yeah, a lot of bars. I think it's known for its, well, the one street was, or one area is called Whiskey Row. Yeah, yeah. But a lot of shops, a lot of restaurants. Nothing, nothing really unique from other western, western, little, towns. western little towns or cities. Um, but it was fun. I like to, you know, again, they have the old buildings, the old uh, courthouse, which certainly has been uh, refurbished. Or but well it, kept. Or, yeah, very well kept. But it was, it was very pretty. Yeah, the lights on it. Yeah. So, yeah. We didn't stay exactly till, you know, pitch dark, so we couldn't really enjoy the lights at their brightest. But it was a fun afternoon. We did take the dogs out around the, the square, mm -hmm. the park, and of course, you know, Zephyr was fine. Monty did much better. I think he's getting more used to people. I think the more we have him out and about, yeah, um, he's, you know, get better at socialization. It's a, it's a work in progress with him. He's a work in progress. Yeah, he's a work in progress. But he was good. We really enjoy our stay at Cave Creek Campground. It's one of our favorite of the Maricopa County campgrounds. The park offers water and electric, and the rates are about $35 per night. It's the second time we visited this park. We stayed here during our Southwest trip last year. Like Randy said, we really did enjoy it, and we probably will be back again. We hope you enjoyed our video. If you did, please subscribe to our channel, Zephyr Travels. And give us a thumbs up, and hit the bell for notifications. We post new videos on a weekly basis. We'd love to have you guys follow along. So until next time, we'll see you guys down the road. Take care. See you care. guys down the road.